So I'm Chris with Let's Dig 18. This job site right here is about a two and a half acre pond I'm building. We've moved about 30 some thousand yards of dirt so far for it. This setup right here, normally we'd be using a smaller excavator and a smaller dump truck. And this is by far just really sped things up as far as the amount of dirt that I'm being able to move in the same amount of time. Earlier this year, I started looking for a bigger machine and ended up coming across that 330. I got that and it's uh, the 45 ton off-road truck. Honestly, it takes like three minutes to load it and you got 35 yards of dirt in there. So compared to my normal setup, when you dump the pile side by side, it's literally twice the size. With one excavator, yeah, it takes a little bit longer to load it, but I'm moving twice the amount of dirt almost with one truckload. So even if I'm here by myself and I only get, you know, 60 loads a day hauled, that would be like 30 loads a day, you know, the smaller truck. So I'm, I'm still doubling what I normally would have hauled with that truck. It's done everything that I've, I could ask for on it, you know. With that truck, instead of having two smaller trucks, honestly, I think I still burn less fuel running a bigger truck versus two other ones. You know, you only have one truck versus two running. The simplicity of that truck, you know, literally you have the shifter, brake pedal, the gas pedal, and the dump. And it's been great because you can pretty much put anybody in it and they can figure it out. As long as you tell them where to dump the dirt, hopefully that's where it ends up at. Tailgates are great on trucks for like doing dirt work and everything. I mean, you can probably put another bucket or two of dirt in there. If you're hauling 70 loads a day, another bucket full of three yards, that's noticeable at the end of the day. This is the most amount of dirt I've ever moved for a pond this size. Building a comfortable tomorrow.